broadcasting from the Lackawanna College Educational Center in Moscow, Pennsylvania. This is your boy, Frankie the Lucky Dog, a.k.a. Frank Calhoun here, reporting another tragic loss in the Louisiana community. Alton Sterling, known in the streets as the CD Man, was an African American who was shot and killed by two Caucasian officers, Howie Lake II and Blaine Solomoni, on July 5, 2016 at 12.35 a.m. in Baton Rouge, Louisiana. Sterling was at the Triple S Food Mart on 2112 North Foster Drive in Baton Rouge selling CDs when a police report was issued stating that Sterling was threatening someone with a gun. When the officers arrived to the scene, they tasered Sterling twice, got Sterling on the ground while he was resisting arrest, pulled out their gun, and fired multiple shots at Sterling's body, killing him on the scene. A later autopsy revealed that Sterling's cause of death was a homicide, suffering multiple gunshot wounds to his chest and back. He was 37 years old. After Sterling died, protests began to surface throughout the Baton Rouge streets. <laughs> A vigil for Sterling was earlier at 6 p.m. at the Triple S Food Mart in Baton Rouge. A meeting for sign making and info meeting will be from 3 to 5 p.m. tomorrow, July 7th, at the LSU African American Cultural Center. Also, the protest for Sterling will take place on Sunday, July 10th, at 4 p.m. at the BRPD building on 4445 Plank Road in Baton Rouge. Let's pray that we all receive justice for Alton Sterling and his family. Being a huge supporter of the Baton Rouge rap scene in the whole Louisiana, it just hits home when something like this happens. Even though I ain't know the dude, you know, Louisiana, the whole music scene, is a part of my influence and what made me today. So when dude was hustling to try to sell CDs and all that, he was getting that quality music out there. The music that turned me into the Kowloon that I am today. So, uh, can't escape it. It's all over social media non-stop. And, you know, just, I wish the world wasn't so corrupt. Ugh. Rest in peace, Alton Sterling. From your boy, Frank Calhoun, broadcasting again from the Lackawanna College Environmental Center in Moscow, Pennsylvania. <laughs>